It's now 2024. Today we're covering all of my predictions that are going to happen in Northwest Arkansas this upcoming year. And I promise you, these are things that you're not going to be expecting. So let's talk about that. Hey, everybody. If you don't know who I am, my name is Philip Shepard. I'm a local real estate agent located right here in Northwest Arkansas. If you weren't aware, I actually was a real estate broker located in the dumpster fire the horrible, the cesspool known as Illinois for way too many years, broke her up there and I was looking for the best place to live in America. I searched high and low across all of America and I ended up in North Arkansas and it is by far the best place to live in America, by far. If you're ever in the area, if you wanna know more about why I chose North Arkansas out of anywhere else in America, let's meet up for coffee, let's talk on the cell phone, text message, whatever the case is. Let's talk about why I chose North Arkansas out of anywhere else in America. And if you haven't been down to Northwest Arkansas quite yet, I made something called the NWA Starter Pack. Sounds like what it is, literally a starter pack full of all the cool things in Northwest Arkansas. What's going on down down Benville? What's going on in Fayetteville? What are the schools like? What are the hospitals like? What are all the cool things you need to know about Northwest Arkansas? Like all, all the things you need to know? Boop, 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 boop. Package, ship right to your home, right to your home. Enter your name below, enter your address below. I'll get the package shipped to you right away. Literally it's full of all the cool things in Northwest Arkansas. And also a side note, it does come with your first free mountain bike, so that's pretty cool. And, 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 and I know what you're thinking, I know what you're thinking. It is my favorite four-letter F word. Free! So enter your information below and make sure they get the package shipped to you right away. All right, and the first prediction we need to cover for North of Arkansas for 2024 is the fact that this will be a big building year for North of Arkansas. Now, the last couple of years, 2021, 2022, and parts of 2023 were big announcement years. There are those years about these are things that are up and coming. And 2024 is going to be the year where things are being built. So when you're coming down here to check this area out, you're going to notice a lot of building happening. That's because in 20, like I said before, 2022, 2023, even 2021, those are core years. We had big announcements and then we started building a lot of things in mid 2023 and we're going to really start really getting heavy in 2024. And I'm not just necessarily saying always commercial spaces, more housing, more nothing like that. I'm talking about actually like a lot of outdoor spaces as well. We're talking brand new parks. We're talking more trail systems. Every year we add, I think about 30 or 40 miles of trail systems onto the already expanded expansive amount of trails we have here. I think we're sitting around 450 of miles of trail systems, uh, both soft and also hard trail. So it will not just end, like actually grow in just the commercial space or the building of actual buildings. We're talking the full gamut. We're talking the both outdoor indoor spaces will are being built in 2024. So again, we've had a lot of announcements the last couple of years. This year is just gonna be a lot of more building and I'm really excited because it's definitely geared towards the outdoor spaces, which I'm always excited and jazzed for. <laughs> And my second big prediction that's happening in Northwest Arkansas this year, and it's gonna actually be slightly tied to economic reasons beyond Northwest Arkansas. So actually this prediction switched dramatically in the last two months. I was not gonna add this to my prediction list for 2024, but it changed drastically. And my prediction is the fact that there's going to be a large amount of people from the coast, both West Coast and maybe inner coast and Texas, moving to Northwest Arkansas. Now, the reason that it wasn't on my list before was because interest rates were so high. There's a lot of other economic factors, which I'm sure we're all aware of, that were kind of sidelining a lot of people from moving. I had definitely some couple clients who did not or could not make the jump from one place to another because their houses got hit on an economic standpoint, like the lost 20% value or the, the interest rates were too high, et cetera. And with all these new economic changes that are happening, especially in 2024, it's going to change the game a lot. So again, to recap, and not this isn't necessarily only for North East Arkansas, there's gonna be a lot of people that live on those coastlines or even on the inner, like outer coast a little bit that are looking to get away from those issues to say the least and they are jumping over to the heartland of America. They are moving from sometimes California to Texas or Texas to North East Arkansas or Utah to even North East Arkansas. So there's a lot of people from the West Coast that are moving to the heartland for obvious reasons. We don't need to get into that, but obviously the heartland, North East Arkansas specifically, has a lot of things going for it, which I'm sure you're fully aware of comparison to other parts of America. Regardless, this will be a big year from a lot of the coastal people that don't really want to live there anymore and uh, maybe the values don't transfer as well there anymore. And they want to get into a more easier way of life, a more family-centric way of life, a more community way of life. And Northwest Arkansas really fits the bill in comparison to a lot of other places in America, obviously. So having that movement over from the West Coast to here is going to definitely happen in 2024. And before we jump on to the next point, 
I have something brand new called Instant Home Updates. So maybe you're looking to move to the area and using things like Realtor.com, Zillow.com, or Redfin. Way too slow. Notifications, way too slow. That's why I made something called Instant Home Updates. Sounds like what it is, little Instant Home Updates. So enter your information below. Name, bedrooms, bathrooms, square footage. Where do you want to move to North Arkansas? Enter all the information below. I make sure you don't miss a single notification when it comes for homes for sale or for rent all in North Arkansas. Also, side note, every single Friday, I send an email out just kind of talking about all the cool things in North Arkansas. What's going on in downtown Benville? What's going on in Faithful? What's going on in downtown Rogers? What new businesses are moving here? What's going on in the amphitheater? What new cool things happen in downtown Fayetteville? What new things you do? So many things all the time, all the time. Enter your email below, enter your name below. I'll make sure that you get that email every single Friday, but something to be aware of, something to be concerned about. You will get a little fear of missing out, a little FOMO, so to speak. But I promise you, you will be the most informed person eventually when you make your way down to Northwest Arkansas. And my third and final prediction for Northwest Arkansas for 2024 is actually opposite of what I've been saying before. A lot of times I've been saying more of this, more of that, blah, 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 blah. This is actually less of something. Yes, you heard me correctly. We're having less big announcements, big things happening in 2024. Now, the reason being is because we had, like I said before, we had a lot of announcements happening in 2021, 2022, 2023. Like I said before, my first prediction is that we're gonna have, this is a big building year 2024, but we're not gonna have these major announcements like we did before because they've already been announced. Now I do, and I've been, I'll be talking about this in future videos, but I do expect that 2025, 2026, is the starting line for Northwest Arkansas. And what I mean by that is that a lot of these, and I'll talk about this in a different video, but a lot of these big things are finishing up in 2025. 2024 is a building year. We're not gonna have as many big announcements as we had in the past from like the Alice Wilson School of Medicine, the new HQ for Walmart. We have, you know, obviously new brand new Whole Foods and new stadiums and the whole thing. We're, like, we're just gonna have less of that. Now, the only thing that might be a little different that I might put like maybe a 15% 15, 15 chance in there is that with the interest rates lowering and the Fed kind of loosening their, their grip on things, it will open up capital. There might be some bigger announcements. I don't think the scale that what we're used to because this is a, well, again, the building year, but I do imagine that companies, again, like I've talked about before, companies like In-N-Out, Southwest, and other companies that haven't really moved into the area yet will start being more comfortable doing that. So I imagine some of those announcements will come is my prediction, but will it be a major, huge announcement? I don't think so as much. Now, 2025, 2026, whole different game. That's, that's gonna be massive years for North Arkansas. This year is a building year with less announcements. But the thing that I truly love about this, that I, that I wanna make a prediction on as well, is the fact that it's not that they're slowing down, they're actually making the things that they're doing better. Better trail systems, better outdoor spaces, better this, better that. They've already had their major focuses, outdoor recreation, really good housing, really good commercial space, affordable housing. They're just making those things better. And so that's what I have a lot of expectations for in 2024 is the fact that they are going to be having less big announcements, but more focus on the core things they already do and just make them even better, which I'm always in favor for. All right, that's all I have for you guys today. Again, if you are thinking about coming down to North East Arkansas, download my three-day itineraries link below. Maybe you're a venturer, maybe you're a sports person, maybe you're a foodie, maybe you're a sightseer, maybe you have kids, whatever it is. There's a three-day itinerary link down below for you. So go ahead and download it and you usually get down here. Also, when you need to come down here, I can give you the $10 tour so I can kind of show you around the whole area. Plus, you can check out some home for sale or for rent and see how far your dollar will go in North East Arkansas compared to where you're coming from. All right, guys, let's see you next one. Ooh.